focus at Mohawk is about commercializing innovation. It's really taking those best ideas that we have and getting them out into the field, getting them used uh, by small and medium enterprises especially, which are really known for their innovation in Canada. Here at Mohawk we have three focus areas in applied research, and call them centers of excellence. Energy generation, digital health solutions, which is mobile health and digital health solutions, and additive manufacturing, which is 3D printing on an industrial scale. One of the ways we connect through with our students with the small and medium enterprises through applied research. We have companies that bring their, their challenging technical problems to the college and we partner with them. We bring our staff, our expertise and our experience in our little niche areas uh, to those companies and we help them get over those humps. And a lot of times we connect them with their students in the labs and they eventually end up hiring the students to, to continue on that work uh, in the future. We have a combination of staff and students and faculty uh, that work together with government agencies, uh, that could be Canada Health InfoWay, eHealth Ontario, um, international health groups. We have worked a lot around standards. So what do the students get around that? They see the proper way of doing business. We bring them in, uh, sometimes through classwork, again, sometimes through co-ops, and they're full members of our team. By full members, we give them ownership over parts of the project. So they're not treated as students, they're treated as junior developers. And with that ownership, they, they really throw themselves into the projects. And they're getting a lot more than they would of just in a classroom setting, uh, very collaborative. The biggest thing that I've gained out of Medic is my ability to grow as a programmer. Um, you learn all these things in school and in classroom, which is great, but until you actually do a co-op term, such as here at Medic, you don't really have a real environment where you could put all of that to use. And so when I came here to MEC, everything I learned, everything that I've gained, I was able to apply to all the projects I had learned. And by doing so, not only did I get to do that in a real world environment, I also got to learn and experience how all of that actually works. I love working here. I like the passion I get every day when I come into work. I love going to work. I love making software. To me, it's like, I'm making something new for somebody every day and actually contributing to things around that will be run in the real world one day. Ultimately it's the people, to be quite honest. I like being around people that can challenge me, do different things that I don't do, and I can add to a team that makes a project awesome. We know that Mohawk College has been instrumental in providing all kinds of skills required for uh, electrical and power sector. But with this kind of research, we are adding another key component, and that's a unique skill set that the college will provide to these students, whether in the classroom, whether through capstone projects, or through the involvement directly with the research we are doing. Our focus in our research is in, on upgrading the uh, power grid and introducing some of the new technologies that we have started to introduce in, uh, in our sector, like you know, from energy sources to energy storage to uh, adding computer interface and networking. We are also interested in the area of re introducing renewable energy, such as solar, uh, wind, uh, some of the new loads, such as electric vehicles and plug-in hybrid vehicles. But we are also interested in some of the new concepts such as energy storage and moving energy back and forth from the residential industrial loads to the grid. At the end of the day, we are providing the industry with turnkey products for students with the utmost needed skill set that they can assume role as soon as they join these companies. We pride ourselves in the partnerships we've had with companies in Hamilton and the region and in fact the province. It's partnerships where our apprentices go to work for companies like ArcelorMittal DeFasco, do their co-op with them, change the curriculum here, and then they become full-time employees with ArcelorMittal DeFasco, the largest trainer of apprentices in the province. So that is a very cool partnership. One of the largest challenges to ArcelorMittal DeFasco is, is finding the right people, skilled people, and people that we believe will lead us to the future in, in our smell de Fasco and innovative solutions in steel. This connection with Mohawk College is essential because they are one of our major suppliers of our key resource people. With currently almost 50% of our employee population retirement eligible, we are going to be in the need of recruiting almost 1,500 people over the next three to five years. 
Of that 1,500 people, almost half of those are skilled trades. We rely on Mohawk uh, and our relationship with Mohawk to supply us those core skills that we need and the selection process from the very beginning of the selection process right through the development of our apprenticeship programs and uh, we rely on them uh, as a strategic partner in that relationship. You know, we have a, a long-standing slogan, our product is steal, our strength is people, and it's those people in the next generation of, of workers at Arsenal DeFasco that will continue to provide continuous improvement in innovation and solutions in steel. Mohawk's strengths have always been in health and technology, just like the city of Hamilton. Advanced manufacturing, additive manufacturing will be the future for both of us. And that's why our next move at Mohawk is a new engineering technology building where companies can come in, work with our faculty, work with our students, try out their ideas on state-of-the-art equipment. And this is how Mohawk is going to continue to advance economic development with our partners in the city.